right, what up everybody? Uh, I am Richard Vigorelli, and I am getting ready to give you the information on the Metal Ox, which is the last of the five oxes, and what the Metal Ox means. But before I get into the Metal Ox itself, let's first talk about just the ox. So the energy of ox is all about hard work. It's about tenacity. It's about being stubborn. It is about getting the job done. Now remember, stubbornness can come in two ways. Basically, stubbornness means that you won't change. Now, if you are, if somebody in a cult is trying to win you over and you're stubborn, well, they're not going to get a follower. If you are stubborn and somebody is trying to save your life by throwing you a life preserver and you're saying, no, God will save me, well, you're going to have a bad day. So, what does metal mean when you pour it on top of the ox? Well, metal, remember, is adaptive, but it's also cold, and it needs warmth to get it moving. Otherwise, it's fairly antisocial. It doesn't like to get out and do things. Metals tend to be loners. So you add that in on top of the ox energy, which is all about hard work, and you got yourself a person that is very content to sit behind a desk, drawing, crunching numbers, and I wouldn't say they're isolated, but we're talking like an accountant type personality. We're talking about a person that wears a suit because it's incidental, not because they want to look good. They wear it because it's just part of the job. That's what they wear to work. I don't really care. This person won't really care if they look good or not. They're not really seeing anybody. They may come in contact with people, but they're going to be kind of awkward. Um, just think of the typical accountant personality. They're not very outgoing. They like numbers. They like facts. They like figures. So this person, this metal ox is probably going to be one of the best accountants you've ever had in your life. The guy will know everything. And he will work tirelessly. He's going to really, really look down on people screwing around in the workplace, like having Nerf gun battles, or um, you know, playing around. They're going to be extremely efficient, and if they don't think that what you're doing is a good idea, the metal ox will tell you, and he will try to explain it to you in the best way he possibly can. In very, very simple terms to him and you'll say to him well I like having fun I like going out for a happy hour during lunch just to have a beer so I can unwind and he'll look at you and say it takes you approximately 20 minutes to reach the bar once they're at the bar it will take you approximately two minutes to flag down the bartender once you have the bartender in your sights it will take him approximately one minute to one and a half minutes to procure your beer, which it will then take you about 20 minutes to drink and about an hour to recover from it so that you can continue on your day. Total time is approximately three hours. You actually have an hour of lunch. You have now wasted two hours of company time. Meanwhile, you're sitting there like, I just wanted to go out for a beer, dude. I asked if you wanted to come, God. That's, in a nutshell, what the metal ox aspect is like. So, this has been my analysis of the metal ox. If you are new to my channel, feel free to uh, subscribe below. If you would like me to run your Chinese chart, please visit my website at vigintmed.com. That is short for Vigorelli Integrated Medicine.com. I'll be sure to get that chart to you as soon as I possibly can. Feel free to leave... Uh, 
some birth information in the comments if you like. Anything you would like me to run, please feel free. Well, guys, been a pleasure with the ox, and I will be back later with the tiger. <sighs> One of my favorites. Take care.